Oh, little kitty, don't pollute our mother earth. That's bad manners. Why? Hmm, to know that, you need to learn how lucky we are to be born on it. Hey friends, so in today's episode, let us explore some vital facts about the home we call Earth. Zoom in! Planet Earth, a giant mass of water and mud revolving in space and the only known home sweet home, formed just for us as it gives us food to eat, water to drink and air to breathe making it a perfect breeding ground for life to evolve. But it wasn't created overnight and took billions of years to become the world we know today. Yes, about 4.5 billion years ago, gravity started pulling the remaining of a dead star along with other small particles of dust, rock and gas that over the next few million years formed a giant boulder and eventually Earth. Our planet is made of four layers. At the center, we can find the solid inner core with a temperature of around 5200 degrees Celsius. This is covered by an outer core with a hot liquidy texture and a temperature between 4,900 to 5,500 degrees Celsius. Around this is a mantle made with a mixture of silicates, magnesium oxide and other metals and non-metals. And finally, we have the rocky outer crust where life exists. At present, the Earth is the third planet from the Sun with a distance of about 93 million miles. Due to the distance between the Earth and the Sun, the temperature on the Earth's surface is neither too cold like on Jupiter and Saturn, nor too hot like in the case of Mercury. Because of this balanced climatic condition, the Earth can hold water in its three states – solid ice, liquid water and gaseous vapor. And as we know, it is due to this availability of water, harboring life became possible on Earth. And today, our world is the home for millions of micro and advanced life forms living in harmony in its biosphere. But it's not just the position, but other factors such as its rotation and revolution also helped to carve the planet into its current form. Yes, this rotation and revolution of the Earth have contributed to many factors like the flat poles and bulge around the equator, the day and night cycle, the season cycle, tides, etc. To know more about it, please check out our video, Earth's Rotation and Revolution, afterwards. And on top of everything, our Mother Earth is lovingly wrapped in an envelope of atmosphere. Though it might come across as just a gaseous layer around our planet, however, it does way more for us than what meets the eye. Yes, some of its tasks include protecting our Earth from harmful radiations of the Sun, dealing with the approaching blazing asteroids, regulating the climate and even lighting up our days. And if you want to know the after effects of losing our atmosphere, then please check out our videos, Layers of Atmosphere and What if the Earth lost its atmosphere? In short, we should be thankful for nature for making the world a perfect planet in all sense. But at the same time, it is our duty and responsibility to protect our Earth by keeping it clean, finding alternative sources of energy and planting more trees. Because right now, there is no other place we can go to and this is the only planet we can proudly call home. Trip!
be on time! Oh, did you know the Earth is the only planet in our solar system that wasn't named after any Roman or Greek god? Yes, Earth is a German word that simply means the ground. Hope you learned something interesting today. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Never mind. <laughs>